Hi, this is Peter from Sempad, the ad tool for agencies. Today I'm going to show you how to review what changes have been made within your AdWords account. This can be very useful if perhaps you have a moment where, you know, performance was not all that good and you think it may be due to some change that was made within the account. Or perhaps performance is incredible and you want to see what was modified that caused that change to happen. Thankfully, Google makes that very easy to do. On any of the tabs, campaigns, ad groups, or keywords, you can click this little view change history link on the right hand side. Once you do that, Google will show all of the changes that have been made for the campaign that you were in. In this case, we were in all campaigns and for the date range that you specify at the top. And you can modify this if there's a certain date range that you want to be looking at. As you scroll down, you'll see that Google groups all of the different types of changes together. Here we have some text ads being created. We have some campaigns being paused, some keywords being paused or modified. Um, basically, it's, it's a big mashup. But the nice thing is that Google does include all of this different data, so it gives you a lot to go back over and process. If you want to see only one certain type of change, then you can click the little filter tab on the left hand side and you can select ad changes, bid changes, keyword changes. Let's look at just ad changes. So now the list will populate with all of the different ads that have been created. As you're scrolling down, you can show the details of each line one by one and see exactly what was done. If perhaps you just want to see everything in one shot with all the details, just click the little show all details at the top here. And this can be a very useful tool if you want to see what people are up to in your account, or perhaps you just want to see what you did because so many changes can be made that honestly, it can be hard to keep track of everything at times. If you want to revert that change, Google also makes that very easy to do. You can just click this little undo button on the right hand side. In this case, you'll see that all of these are grouped as a single uh, modification. We'll look at some keyword changes just to have a little clearer picture. So all of these changes happened in one instance. So Google will group them all together. And if you want to undo them, then you have to undo it as a group. It's not, it's not possible to say undo only this one little element of it. It has to be done on the entire action that was taken at one point in time. But Google does break it up by moment by momentary changes. So you can undo these, you can undo these, they will be independent of each other. And essentially, when you click undo, whatever it does will be reverting this exactly. So status changed from enabled to paused. If you click undo, it will change from paused to enabled. And it will be as if this never happened. If you decide that you're happy with everything, you've seen all that you want to see, you can click this little Manage Campaigns button and you'll end up back in the standard AdWords interface and able to make changes to further improve your campaigns. I hope this video has helped. If you're interested in more online advertising tips and tricks, please subscribe or feel free to ask any questions in the comments section. If you happen to manage online ads for an agency or as a freelancer, I strongly recommend you have a look at Sempad.com. It's an ad reporting and optimization platform for Google, Bing, Facebook, and more with dashboards, bidding algorithms, weekly suggestions, and other tools to make your life easier. Visit Sempad.com for a free trial and start saving time today.